how can a number be so large that you can't explain it? Can't you just put N to the power of X or the other way round or use a, a Greek symbol or something? The easiest way I find to think about this is to think about the number of atoms there are in the universe, which we estimate to be 10 to the power of 80. Uh, it's a very, very large number. This is one <laughs> followed by 80 zeros. Oh, okay, that's the simple thing. <laughs> that's understand. the simple thing. Okay. Yeah, just, you know, just have the, the entire universe in your mind. <laughs> okay. 10, 10 to the 80 and yeah. then we'll go for it from there. So okay. 10 to the 80 is an operation called exponentiation, but BB6 requires us to go beyond exponentiation and we're now doing tetration. So while two to the power of three is eight, two tetrated to three is two raised to the power of two to the power of two, which is equal to 16. So that's not too difficult, <laughs> but two tetrated to five is a number with almost 20,000 digits. Okay, we're getting we're getting quite big. Yeah, that number's actually quite small yeah. uh, <laughs> when compared to, to BB6 though. So remarkably, BB6 is at least two tetrated to the two, tetrated to the two, to the nine. Uh, so this is this tower of iterated tetration and I, that's that's the best I can do. I, I can't I can't compare it to anything that's even remotely familiar. It's absolutely ludicrous.